Want to play a game? One dripstone, one rubbish, one leaves, one stone, and... Hey! Hello everybody! I hope you're having a wonderful Christmas. Uh, I'm back playing my Vault Hunters Sky Vault. And as you've probably just seen in the intro, I've set up the first villager. So I've got a Fletcher, uh, which is going to be great for me to make arrows. And I've also made our first altar crystal. And the reason I've gone straight for all this actually is, if you haven't seen, uh, and I'll put a link to it if you haven't seen, uh, I did a co-op. I started a co-op version of Vault Hunters in the overworld with my wife. And um, we went straight into the altar and the chest was so good. So I think actually, in some ways, even though I've got this cool helmet and this cool legs and my sword, um, probably would have been better just going into the altar uh, crystals much, much quicker. Um, because things like, you know, we've got shulker, sh uh, shulker boxes already and stuff like that. So um, I am going to take into this vault. I've got I brought a chest with me and a shulker cell just in case we do get the other shulker shell. Um, and we'll be able to make one straight away. But yeah, so we're going to go straight in. Here we go. I've got everything. I think I have. Yeah, I've got everything. Now, don't be a festive vault. This is a really hard. It's not a festive vault. Oh, it's a sand vault. Now, actually, in a weird way. Oh, I don't need to do that here. In a weird way, on the co-op one that we were doing, this ended up being um, probably where we got most of our loot from, I think, although the mobs are tough. Right, so the portal is east. We have three monoliths. Um, yeah, I need to work out my buttons again. I forgot what my buttons are because I moved definitely around because my thumb was dodgy. A bit better now. I've just got uh, a couple of strips on it, so I could actually be able to use it. But no excuse. Right, so we're on the lookout for chests straight away. I also, I don't think it's been picked up. Let's just have a look at my levels. I've got my new 3D printer next to me, uh, and it's making a bit of a racket. <laughs> so hopefully, you can't hear it going on in the background. Anyway, right, let's see what's going on. This is a weird room, isn't it? Where's the chest, man? Must be up. Must be up. Can we go up here then, left and right, maybe? Uh, no? No! Oh, look, over there and up there. Okay, so it's up the waterfalls. Yes. Oh! 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 I forgot to turn it on. Hi! I forgot to turn it on. I've been moving the room around, so my face is in a different way. My, my monitor's over this way now that I'm looking at, so... Um, yeah, things look a bit different, that's why. There's an easy way up here, so let's go up to this one first and let's see what we got. Ah, let's rather than do that, let's do this. It was falling. Is there going to be anything here? It's such a weird room. Oh! Now, uh, there was something. I don't know where, though. I heard it. Where did you guys monster up from? I don't know. Anyway, we can get straight across to this one. So that's a good start. Now, let's see. I did really well with not just dying on the last one. I think I've still got it on easy. Oh, that's my poison cloud, isn't it? I've still got it on easy on here, and I might change that at some point, because on the co-op one we've been playing on, uh, on normal, I think, or whatever it is by default, we didn't change anything. So... Uh, and I wasn't dying, so that's all doing quite well. Look at this bad boy up here. It's got off some goodies. Hello, sir. Yeah, hi. Yeah, it definitely still a difficulty up. They do die a bit too fast now, I think. I think it's when you're getting overwhelmed. But, um, I mean, that's part of the challenge, right? Getting overwhelmed and dealing with it. So, yeah, I think I'll probably... Hey, I'll probably turn that difficulty back up. But So this might be our last easy vault. That's okay. It was good to do it and get used to it, so... Uh, we didn't get a shulker shell, did we? No, no extra one. Let's go down here and then we can go into that corner. But yeah, I'm 100% I'm going to use the excuse of my thumb for everything, because... Uh, well, why not, eh? <laughs> I wasn't rubbish, I've just got a dodgy thumb. That's, that's the excuse. Right, this isn't a sizzler, but that's okay. Let's just loot everything very quickly. Oh, that is a trap. Where are they coming from? Let's get out of the way of the main spawner. Hey! Go on in, fellas. Yeah, you see that? Like, pretty much one hit. Pretty much killed them. I definitely need to turn them back up to normal. Not normal. Maybe it's a hard... I'll go to normal first. Let's not get too ahead of ourselves, eh? Right, so... Is there a way... I think there was a way down, wasn't there, as well, but... I still don't fancy bucketing my way down to places. Oh, but there is something. Oh, I'm gonna have to do it. Aren't I? 
Let's see, can I not die? Oh yes, look at that. Look at that. Now let's see, is it an altar? It's over that way. Is it an altar or is it... It's a monolith in the first room. Yes. Great work. Right, let's go for this one. Are you going to sizzle? You're not. You're not, you're not, you're not. Well, that's okay. Oh, there's the shulker shell. Excellent. That was the main thing I was looking for. Let's back away. Come on in, fellas. Yeah, in the face. And you. Brilliant. Right, before we do anything, we need a crafting table. Put that there a minute. You, and you, and you, and where's that chest? There it is. Awesome! Right, that's going to give us so much more space. I just need to not die now. <laughs> as long as I don't die, uh, then this could go well. Yeah, we'll leave that on there. Let's make our way around, see if there's any more chests in here. I think there will be. This looks like a, a place where death would be. Yeah, did it sizzle? It, I don't think it did. I'm not sure, actually. Can't see this one. No, it definitely didn't. Let's leave what we can. Oh! Oh, there's a baby behind me. I think. Yeah. Down you go. There's one chest there that I really want to get to. It's the black one there. Oh, and that's a creeper. Heal. I think... We may just have to ignore that one because um, that one may be death. Death, 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 death. I need to pay more attention to what I'm doing. That's a wooden chest. I'm going to skip. I'm going to skip. Because what I really, really want to find is some of the chests that might have the gear in. Um, which I keep forgetting which way around it is, either ornate or gilded, but that's what I want to find. Right, I think we've done, we've done all right in this room. They're much more than normal, and that's the uh, that's what I'm aiming for. You know, diving and just sort of going through and going, ah, monolith, ah, this. Exploring the vaults properly now. Definitely had enough experience with it. I've just got to not get lost. <laughs> it's my big thing. So let's see what we've got here. It'd be amazing if you like, managed to loot loads of the chests and find all the monoliths. I have a feeling that's not the case, though. Uh, there are wooden chests up there. I'm not against the wooden chests. Um, but it'd be nice to see if we can find anything a bit nicer. I'm going to keep going. I can always loot here on the way back. Keep going and see what I can find. Yeah, I think this, this is much better already. Oh, that's a good sign. Oh, it's a second monolith. Now, I'm thinking we should, in fact, prioritise the monoliths in this particular case. So we've got lots of loot, and the monolith would be huge as well. Let's keep going and see if we can find the monolith. Uh, we'll only stop We'll stop for the, um, the Omega chests, I think. Not Omega chests, uh, Gilded. They called Gilded? I forgot what they're called now. The red and, the red and black ones. It is in the book. I always forget. I don't think there was one in here at all. So, we're going to go this way now. Didn't see any of the nice chests. See if you gilded on or not. You have to put up with that. Me constantly forgetting how to do absolutely everything. And the names of everything. All the time. But when I'm streaming, I'm definitely going to stream um, this one. This is definitely... Uh, Definitely the one that I'm going to stream. You'll be able to shout at me in the comments. Like the comments in the chat, sure. Uh, in fact, yeah, and at the end as well, I will I'll link at the end. I've made my channel for, not my channel, my, my profile for streaming. I'm going to be streaming on Twitch. Um, I wanted to stream on YouTube, but the lack of support from YouTube on things like keeping people safe on the live categories if you ever looked at some of the live categories they're not being well moderated so i don't want my stuff mixing in there i don't want you know if you've got kids who watch me i don't want your kids 
accidentally stumbling across some of that nonsense. So, and YouTube are just not replying. So, if they're not going to reply, then, you know, the least they could do is say we're looking into it, but they don't even get a reply. So, yeah, so I'm going to go over to Switch for streaming. So, I'll link all that at the end. We're definitely going to go over here, these cool living chests. Right, so I think that noise there, that constant thwomp, 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 I think that means it's an ambush spawner. So, it's lots of mobs, but it sizzles. I don't think there's as many mobs there as there was when I was playing it on normal. Uh, but that makes sense, I suppose. Oh, and another shulker shell. It's so much better. If you are playing Sky Vaults and you followed my advice last time of it's probably a good idea to just go through and get the monoliths. It may not be the best advice now I've been playing it the other way around. I don't know, because you get lots of the other stuff as well. And like the raw vaults are good for collecting materials. I mean, that is the point of them. But obviously these ones are going to get you all the loot. So, right. Can't see any easy chests that way, so let's go back. I'm going to leave these because... Um, if I do get lost, they're all there. I usually break them. But I've started to think that if they're there and I do get lost, then at least if I just find one randomly in a room, I'll just go, haha. Although it's that one. And I'm mostly breaking it just because I don't have ulti like unlimited resources to my sky vault, but I think I've got I've got an easy way of getting wood. So the amount of trees that we've got growing on at the minute. New problems. Just double checking some of the rooms because because we've only got the um, version one of, of uh, Seeker Hunter, then the radius isn't always the best. See, like that that didn't show before. And, ooh, I think that that is. I think unfortunately we can double check, but I think that's going to be an altar. And that's one thing so far I've not been able to quite sort of say. Oh yeah, they're worth it. The altars have not been worth it when I. I'm gonna fuse those. Now that's a, that is definitely oh a baby and a creeper. That is some worse nightmare uh, nightmare fuel right there in one place. Oh it's good though. Let's pop you out. And let's get the shulker down. Doing great stuff. Right. <clears throat> let's prioritize. There's probably some rubbish in here that we don't need, but we'll still keep. Uh, never right, yeah, 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 burger parts. Don't need endurocyte, I love the way it's spawning there. Let's just... Anything else that's put in there? Don't really need, don't really need sticks. I'll keep them in here, because it's always handy, but... Be great for now for trading. With our new Fletcher. Let's get rid of you. Keep on going. Right, yeah, so it is an altar. Yeah, it is definitely an altar. So let's uh, let's do one from that. Not a got an altar. What time are we on? 13 minutes left. We're okay. Where's the way out again? It's the other side. I've got to practice my uh, my water bucket jumping for sure. Because uh, there's been a few times where I've just completely splatted into the ground. But yeah, so much loot. So much loot, it's definitely worth doing it this way. Like, get on the altars as soon as you're able to not die. That is um, that is now my advice. Right, we're going to go this way now. If we get a monolith now, this will be um, this will be a really, really successful vault. Really successful. Oh, I forgot about dash as well. What's that? Come on! Oh, right. Can we see? Chests aren't that visible. I'm thinking what we'll do is if we get to five minutes and we haven't found, oh, and we haven't found the monoliths, we'll just go and greed as many chests as we can near the portal. That'll be uh, fun. But I think for the, the monolith chests, so that we're sort of going back to the monolith crates, if you get those, I think out of them all, there's only been one where I've not had a piece of gear. Um, oh, where are you? Definitely above. So we're probably going to get ambushed in a second. See if we can spot them. And not. Oh, yeah, they're all down there. It's down low, not above. Okay. I'm not sure they can actually get up to us. We'll find out when we come back to this room. Let's keep going. I 
they're so well designed, aren't they? I, I think I say this every time, but the, uh, the actual design of the bolts, absolutely incredible. Great building. Oh, now they're worth going for. Some ores, straight off the bat. Let's top this up. Let's start piling. Yeah, you guys spawn. Hopefully, oh no! That was not what I wanted to happen. That was the complete opposite to what I wanted. At least it wasn't a creeper. That would have been terrible. <laughs> I've survived just about though. So I'm not sure I see in that didn't fizzle because I've just seen another mob drop. Let's see. Did. Okay. Ha! <laughs> Hello there! Didn't notice you. There's a lot more mobs somewhere. Oh, they're over there. Look at that. Let's see if we can kill them. We'll get the XP if we kill them. There's a ton of them. I'll tell you what, we're going to mine this first and I might bridge over. Give all them a bit of a whooping. A bit high here, so. Hopefully, we'll get some ores out of it. Although I think that broke into nothing, which does happen. It's basically a chance. Let's go over, let's... Let's do it. Did they all manage to get down? They didn't, they're all stuck. Brilliant. Hello! Yeah! That poison cloud from the sword is fantastic. Oh, I think there's another mod there. Hello there. Goodbye. Um, there's more chests there though, I may as well go for them. Fix that one as well. Can. Let's put some of the junk in. Do -do 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 -do. I'm keeping the scaffold in because I haven't I don't think I've got bamboo yet. And I guess it could come up on the altar. So that's why I'm. Uh, that is exactly what I'm keeping it. <gasps> oh my god! I fell! Wow! I properly fell. Uh, right. Nearly a disaster. But we're okay. Phew! That was panic. I've got two there. Whoop. Definitely need to get feather falling. That is um, one thing. I think the second villager that we're going to put in is going to be someone who can do me feather falling. I know this like fortune would be good and efficiency would be good for lots of other reasons, but I think for me personally, uh, my my personal play style of falling to my death quite regularly. Feather falling is going to be a big help. So I was fully healed up. And you see, I've said about heal, it, it is amazing. Like, you know, I've fallen there, it was pretty close. I wasn't like gonna die specifically, but it was pretty close to it. Um and I'm back to full health. Just got with my mana to come back up and I'm pretty much in a perfect place. Where did it go? It died. It died. Right, we're seven minutes. So I don't think we're gonna find the third monolith. Which is a shame. So let's get back to the first room and we'll go either side of that one check for the monoliths in there. It might be, I don't know. We're going to pick it. But... Well, although we didn't get any bulk gear, we've got so much stuff. Like, the shulker box alone is huge. And I think we definitely got at least one, yeah, one more shulker shell. We might even get another one. Two shulker boxes would be ridiculous. Just the amount of stuff we'll be able to loot. And then there's another mod called Pouches, which does look really good because it's basically just like extra inventory space. But if I've got a shulker box or two, I'll probably leave it. I'm very tempted to take the bolt compass, which people will be going, no, 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 it's a waste of time. But for me, I always get lost. You know, you can see if I don't put these down and I don't do them perfectly, I'm never getting out. So I think a bolt compass might be, uh, might be my best thing. I hold it in my offhand all the time and make sure I always get back. Uh, oh, I've gone too far. See, look, even with the uh, with the scumpus, I 
I've gone the wrong way. So, my way back. Oh, hang on a minute. Did I just go way too far? I think I did. I think I did. Yeah. So, and we know the portal is east, so that should be my way over that way. Yep. Yep, 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 yep. Right, we need to get a wriggle on. Five minutes. Let's get back to the room just before the portal. So the first the first room that we could loot. I think that was this one. That was a something from a spawner coming. I can't bother dealing with you randomly, so you can just go there. I think this was the first room, wasn't it? Can I see the portal yet? to confirm oh it wasn't it was not look at this one Let's see can I see a portal yet that's the portal right excellent we're gonna go well Go south. We're going to will it to happen. We're going to will the monolith to be set. No green. Like right, wooden chest and me. Uh, yeah. Okay. Let's keep going. Oops. Interesting to see like, any of you guys that are playing this. What do you do? Do you prioritise the crates over everything else? Or do you prioritise the, the chests? Or do you just do a bit of both? I'm thinking a bit of both is the way to go. Uh, while time's running low, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna waste some wooden chests. I know that much. Oh come on! This could be amazing. Where are you? Where have you where have you come with me? I don't know. Oh you were above. There we go then. Good night. That's potentially some ores there as well. But I'm more interested in the monolith. If I, oh, I didn't realise they're coming from both sides. Bowman as well. Oh, that would kill me. Even on easy, that would kill me. Let's get across here in a minute. Let's try and block these in. Just so it's not as easy. Where is the monolith? Or oh, whatever it is. In there. Oh, it's an altar. It's an altar. Down here. Yeah, you guys can all die there. Oh, I thought we'd got it then. Right, we need to sort these out so we don't just die. Oh, it's a bowman as well. Oh! Down you go. View! Right, so I think up here. Uh, no, where's the door? Can't find. Whoa, another baby. Let's go back. We got two minutes. Let's go back to the main room. We'll go see if we can quickly head north. One room. See if there's a monolith in there. Oh, I thought we cracked. I got so excited then. It was an altar. It was an altar. room go really really fast like literally this room and that's it 
probably even enough time to loot. Come on now, green sparkle. Oh, oh it's an altar. I can tell because of the, the building there. What a shame. Is there any easy green chests? I don't think there are. Let's get out safe. We've got less than a minute. Because, you know, if we get caught up on something, then we're going to regret it. i got to run. Run! We're safe. We're home. Awesome. I think we did really well. Really, really well. Let's have a look at all the loot. Let's see what we got. Decent chunk of XP as well. So let's definitely let's do this before we do anything else. Everything's Oh, I save and quit. I didn't mean to save and quit. Get back in the world, so everything's back on normal now. Just take a little while to uh, load in. Back in, we're back in. Let's um, let's see what we got. Let's put this down. That is a really, really good haul. A really good. Haul. I'm I'm really happy with that. That's the most stuff from a vault that, that I've had, and you know that obviously comes from running the the altar. But my understanding at the start about. Um, you know how to sort of get stuff quicker it's not the case run the vaults definitely run the vaults let's just put all this away so this chest is my chest of vault stuff at the minute i need to sort it out into um these things that make more sense but that, that was a really good run i'm really happy with that we had some of those didn't we yeah go for shells yeah so we did get two so we can make another chest awesome we're gonna have a double shulker up going on that's going to get us loads more loot brilliant uh that is a burger one you go in there sticks go down here i'm going to make some more stick bundles i think yeah now i'll do so i don't know if you've seen it but the stick stack really cool actually you can although we're going to probably trade them all anyway, but you can essentially compress your sticks like that and then you can just uncompress them afterwards it's really really wicked uh right so Gold nuggets, put these away. I'm thinking, I'm pretty certain I've got a raw crystal. We could go and quickly run a raw and see how that goes. Um, you never know, it might be like a two monolith. Plenty of uh, netherite scraps as well. And there's another crystal ready anyway there. So yeah, we're definitely, uh, definitely in the business. Keep going there. Diamond nugget. That's really cool as well. Diamond nuggets. Oops. Didn't mean to do that. I do want to do that though. Sort that. That's looking cool. It's looking good. We're now, because the other thing is, we want to be able to build some of the different tables, like the bounty table. And I don't think we need this. Do we need the soul shard bit now? I can't remember now. It might be a menu. Is it a menu? It's not one of that. It's not that one. Not that one. Keep going. Got a feeling it's an F key. It's not. I don't know what it is. I'll have to find out. Uh, let's have a look in keys. Key bindings. So, no. Shard. Yeah. I'm not sure. I'll have to check. In fact, it'll be in the book. It'll be in the book. What it's for. So we can do this. Shards. Soul shards. So, in the soul shard pack. Now, that's no longer up to date. Definitely don't need that one. Black Market, it's called. That's the name that we should have been looking for. So if I now bring up my keybinds, I'm pretty certain now the Black Market is just a keybind. Or maybe it's not. Maybe it's not. Let's have a look. 
Let's have a look. No. So you do still need to make the black market. What do we need to make it? Oh. Market table. It's really, really cool. There it is. So we need chromatic iron block. Driftwood. Oh, we might be able to make this. Ah, we need chromatic steel. I've done that the wrong way, haven't I? Uh, let's do this. I'm still learning the uh, the modded stuff. But that's how we do that one. That's okay. And then to do chromatic iron. Uh, hang on, I got myself confused. There, I? Yeah, just chromatic iron block. We might be able to do it. Because I've got a ton of it. Uh, one thing there, so, chromatic iron block. Uh, can I do this? How many do we need? I forgot. We only need three and some driftwood and a soul shard. Let's make it! In fact, let's get all of those out. And let's get this out. Let's make whoop, let's make one of these. Excellent. Put this stuff back. Uh, I'll smell all that up later as well. So I don't think we're gonna have enough to buy anything decent, but for now. At least we can make it and we can get on with it. Where should we put it? Uh, we'll put it here for now, but it definitely needs a better place because look at look at look at the design. This is such a brilliant block, isn't it? I absolutely love it. Um, so we're gonna hear empty flasks. That's what we use empty flasks for. Um, find them in the living chest anyway. Benny is like jewel. Suck at the vault pickaxe for farming. Okay. That's another empty flask for more money. Oh, we can random it at 350. I think probably out of these we're gonna go for that. I don't know if we've got any empty flasks. Let's see. Let's see. Did we get any already? All right, so these two. Hmm. Might be quite rare. I don't know. Uh, right. Let's see the other one, the bounty table. Now, the bounty table is really cool. But what the bounty table lets you do is if you go into a vault, it gives you a bounty like kill X of these or do some of that. Block of netherite is probably what's going to stop us there. We've definitely got the iron. I can make a loon. Block of netherite, and that's vault dust, isn't it? Essence. Bolt. Oh, bolt essence. How do we get bolt essence? Ah, oh, using the wrong thing. Maybe that's just something we need to find. Bolt essence. Don't think we've got it. Unless you get it from a diamond, maybe. Oh, hang on. Right there, isn't it? It was bolt essence, wasn't it? Bolt essence 2. I don't think we're going to have the netherite. No. Once we get the netherite, we'll definitely get that set up. Uh, yeah. Awesome. Let's take this. Let's run another raw vault while we can. We'll finish on a raw vault. If it's two monoliths, then we've got a good chance to get some more gear. Um, oh, well, do you know what? I've ne I've, we've, we've not completed one of these. Let's try and complete one. So, which way is the portal? The portal is north. The portal is north. And it tells us exactly what we need for each one. So blood vial from coins and then the different types of chests so everything except for wooden chests what we need. Right. Oh, 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 I made a mistake. Let's quickly grab some of these. I haven't got my scumpus blocks. Oh, man. Oh, don't do that. That will cause fire. Yes, yeah, so if you mine the, uh, mine anything that's holding up a lantern, a lantern drops on the floor, it will just set fire to everything. So... Just quickly grab some of these. And then they're in. Right, we've got a stack. We've got a stack. Right, that's the point where we return the stuff in. This is good. It's going to force us to do some chests. Now, we are on normal, so this is going to be a good test for us. Let's see if I'm, uh, if I'm capable of doing it on normal now. And this is a, an ambush uh, spawner. Only three mods, that's pretty cool. There we go. So... What is it that we need from these again? From the living chest, we need an empty jar. None of those are an empty jar. It's okay. Um, right, so there's stuff up there. That is not the room. Yeah. See if there's anything in this corner. There's a down. Let's get down there. The good thing is with this is that like with like with the um, with the monoliths, you obviously you're scouring all over for. 
for the um, for the monoliths themselves. But actually, in this one, it's just find as many chests you can. Whoa! That was a scary one. Bye. Now that did hit me quite hard. And I've spawned something else and I don't know where from. It's going to be around here or something, aren't we? I don't want to do too much, but what I don't want to do is drag a load more mobs, and I think I just did do that. I don't know where they spawn from. I think oh I think they spawn from here, so Oh You know what? None of these are what we want. None of these are the chests that we want, so let's um let's get out of here. Let's, we're gonna spawn some more mobs, but okay that's fine, let's just get let's get out of dodge. Oh wooden chest as well. Right forget this place and let's go to the next one i've got some black mob essence though let's go turn that in why can't i run ah have i got any of the other stuff spine soul charm blood vial empty jar and uh, no no it's one talking you do get loads of uh loads of nonsense <laughs> when you're doing this stuff i'm gonna keep that there always handy um, yeah, let's get out of this one. The reason I'm going to keep all those scavenger things is you can turn them into soul cards. There's a, I think it's got a soul diffuser, and you can recycle the items into it, so we'll definitely do that. Now we're going to keep going on this one, because there's not many chests on this bit. Um, we didn't kill some... Oh no, that was from the mob, so we've killed the mob, so this is all now about finding chests and coin piles. I don't think Hunter will show me sort of the chest that we need to do this. I don't think it will. It only shows me the, the altars to turn them in, and we know there's one right at the start, which is great. But if we see any decent chests. I see anything. There will be stuff out there. Let's get down. That's all woodens. We don't need wooden chests on our list, so. Let's see, all wooden, all wooden. I think, I think it, oh, I think there's some coins there. Oh, was it coins or is it just the edge of that? I think it's probably just the edge of that one. I think it was the edge of a chest. It's funny, isn't it? When you're looking for stuff, sometimes you just see it everywhere. Now that is a chest that we need. However, I've just triggered something else. So let's clear these off before we're going to get some more. Especially these things. Terrible with those things. They do absolutely whoop me. That means that we triggered something here and did it go away. It did. We may as well do it. It sizzled. But in this corner, it is definitely, definitely some of the good chests. Some of the things that we maybe need for the scavenger. And this is an ambush spawner. You can hear them. Oh, you need to go quickly. Yeah, there we go. Yeah, the bow's really hurt. Really, really hurt. And it's jar. That is one of the things that we needed. Let's see what we're going to chuck away here. We chuck that. Let's just throw some stuff away that we don't have. And coal. We don't need dirt. Let's just get rid of some of these for now. You are definitely a, one of the things that we need. Don't need you. End of the world. Let's just go with that for now. Is there any more chests? That's a lot, isn't it? Uh, but I'm going to say these. Because I think, I don't know if I definitely Maybe you need these for something. I've got in my head that I was taking them because I needed them for something, but I'm not sure now. Right, let's open. No, not my pick. No! No! Oh! Oh my word! That could have been horrendous. Empty jar. What do we need now? Blood vial, spider charm, creeper eye. Let's find our way back up. What we on? 18 minutes. Plenty of time. It's not that way. 
How do we get back up? Maybe this way. Get ourselves healed up as well. I think as long as we survive this already, we're going to get to level 5 as well. It's really, really cool. Let's try and go up there. Let's see what there is. Spawn, but you shouldn't be able to land. Oh, oh yes, you will. Oh, that was some terrible piling up. Oh, no. Bring this quick. No. Have a heart. Oh, that was lucky. Lucky, lucky, lucky. I need to look where I'm piling better. That was a terrible pile up. Did it? It did. Uh, yeah, it did, but it's not the stuff that we want. We can take a minute, I think, to um, just make ourselves a bit more healthy after that mistake. Get a good look at... Oh, that's just where we've already been. I think we need to go next room. Wow! Oh, there's a new one. Hello there. Goodbye. Oh, because the spawner didn't actually die. I don't know why I thought that's the other way. Oh. What I really wanted to do was just get back on here. I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it anyway. Oh, let's just get back on here and then hopefully do this without any more mobs spawning. Definitely mobs though. I heard it. I heard it. Hello. Oh, it's a roof. I've got no mana. Yeesh. I think in this box. Uh, in this box. <laughs> more potions there is. Let's take it. Don't need you now. Put all of this away while we are setting ourselves out. Yeah, the shield box makes such a big difference. Such a huge difference. Where did we come Came in that way. Let's get, let's get to a new room. So anyway, coin piles, gilded chests, living chests. Come on, mana. Doing up at least to get my, heat, my health back up. Right, so this is an end room. Or the end of a room. The end of a direction. It's got to be something. Oh. It's not. Mark over here. Where do you get lost? Now we complete a scavenger vault. Three items we need. We just need to. Where are the three items going to be? Something spawned. And again, the whole. We're being chased by lots of stuff all of a sudden. Now this room looks like it's just a big spiral, so that's pretty cool. How do we get up to the next part of the big spiral? Do we have to pile? Maybe we do. Maybe we do. Need a down. Oh, the mobs come from down. Well, let's go down here then, because we may have already sizzled out a spawner. Baby! Goodbye, baby. What was that noise? Sound like a witch. Oh, it's a wraith. Look at that wraith up there. You know what? While we can. I hate those things. They're a brilliant mob that's been put in, because it does make it really tough. Uh, oh, more mobs. Although, I think it did fizzle. More wooden chests, though. Not what we need right now, but... Take it while we're here. Nothing else hidden. No. Not over this way, are we going to come across something? What are you? Well, what are you on? Oh, your oars. And vanilla oars. I don't know. Let's get out of this place. <clears throat> I don't think we're getting uh, anything we want from this room. So let's go back. Just to make sure we don't get chased by any randomness. Let's do that. We're in a good place again now. Like, heal. It's like, if it, without heal, I either would have been dead. Or at a minimum, we'd have been running out with no chance of completing. That was such a great one to take. 
be interesting to know though. Did you guys, if you guys have uh, been playing this, what did you take as your first one? Did you take heal as well? I can't imagine you didn't. Maybe. Oh, this is another villager room. Why have I done that? Why did I do that? It is a villager, but I don't think I can pick it up while it's in that farm, can I? No. If we had a golden apple, we could cure that fella. But we didn't, so we can't. The chest's a bit, I can't remember. No. No, nothing what we need. Didn't mark the room. Oh, we did mark the room. Nothing that we haven't got yet. Not good. Uh, so down there is, is obviously going to be ores, which is very cool. But I think because we're on this scavenger hunt, we'll just focus on that. Oh, it's such a habit to um, to just trigger Hunter when you go into a new room now. Let's go up. Let's go up. Let's see what's up here. It's all wooden. It's all wooden. Hopefully it'll give us a good look. Ah, oh, it's a mob trap. Living chest, that's one thing that we do want. Oh, front and back. Oh my word. Hit things, hit them. Oh. I don't know what just happened, but I seem to not be able to hit anything then. Oof, right, wooden chests. Those babies over there are what we do want. So I assume we can run around to that, to that pillar. Oh man, that's scary. Good. Upping that difficulty to normal for me, I think, is good because it's there's not a lot of danger. I think in the last one there was there wasn't really much danger, other than like the mistakes I made in, with the mobs. There's so much more danger now. So it should be. It should be dead easy. Ah, oh, I don't know why I didn't. Have them. Maybe I could potentially break that spawner, but I know I can't. I've tried it a few times already. Is that the only one? Just one. Oh no, and I don't think it even had the thing that I wanted. Whoa. What was it doing here from the living chest? We need a creeper eye. Didn't get a creeper eye. I didn't get a mystery egg. I don't actually know what to do with them. I'm going to have to look that up. Oh, making my eyes water. Making my eyes water. Right. Come on, not wooden chests. I reckon in a in an altar vault, these are probably much easier. You can get more variety of chests, I think. That is all wooden chests, that's all wooden chests. That's nothing. I don't see anything there. Can we see anything like peeking? For nine minutes, conscious of time. An altar down there. We could we quick look and see if that altar does lead us to anything cool. I don't know if it works that way. I don't know if it's a random placement. I think it's right. Let's just go. Let's move on. Let's move on to see what we can see. Let's see what we can see in the next one. Heal again. Let's get ourselves back up. Uh, oh, is that coin piles? Got some wooden chests. I think I've been fooled by candles. No, there is. There's coin piles there. Excellent. All right. I should be using vein miner on these, uh, but I've forgotten what my button is. So. I think it goes quicker, but we did get the blood vial then, so that's great news. Oh! Oh my! Where did you guys come from? Oh! It didn't fizzle. I see. Let's not risk it anymore. I thought it had sizzled. It didn't sizzle. Vials. Get these on. 
Awesome. Uh, let's go this way. Why not? Ah, uh, some farm room. It's not going to help us. Let's go back this way to where I've, I've, I've lost count now if we were. If we'd already branched off or not. I think we did. Seven minutes. Seven minutes. Maybe I'm it's it's that waking way back near the portal and then work instead of being like the far end of the portal. We work outwards from there. That is a maybe a good follow. Yeah, I'm not dashing as much because man is low. We've taken quite the beating. The living chest and gilded chest. I need to work out the thing. I double tap W to run. I need to work out this. I know there's a way that people don't do that better. So I need to, I need to have a look at that. If anybody knows, tell me. Tell me in the comments what you do. What's the like the run button or technique that people use? So thinking this, I don't think there's any reason why I ever would not want to run. Yeah, let's get back to the very first room. So we're near the portal. There's, I still would like to escape from my life because we are going to level up, which is awesome. Definitely going to level up. Probably it for what they've done. Yeah. It's a good one as well. I didn't hit my head or anything. Oh, hi there. That's a living chest. That is a living chest, and it's a living chest that I definitely haven't looted. Let's get up there. Don't fall on your back side. Thank you. You can go that way. Didn't need to do that one, though. Uh, it was a bad place to do that, actually. But it's okay in the end. Maybe. Although... I think it was a good way. Maybe it wasn't. Uh, oh, I can squeeze the chest. Oh, there's a creep right in there. Brilliant. Let's see. Oh, I don't want that. Let's get rid of some of this stuff. Is it the only... Wow, I only need one. May as well try and loot that one though, just because. Nothing else. It's XP, isn't it? There might also be something good in there. Right, we need to try and get down safely. Oh, look over there. That's not the right chest though, but it is the chest that may have bolt gear in. We've got an interesting job to do though. Can we get down here? Oh no! That wasn't the way for our interesting job to start. Don't die. I'm stuck on something. Don't die. Oh, look at that. That poison cloud is really, really good. Now, we've got the eye. And this isn't the chest that we need for it, but look. Look, that's the chest that can have gear in. It's worth it. Empty jar. Oh, a netherite helmet. I'll definitely take that. And you... And uh, not you. Maybe a bit of coal. Any more? Any more for any more? There's some coins. Let's get them. Let's get this guy shot if we can. Same for you. Let's just get rid of you. I don't want you falling on my head. I've got three minutes to find. I've not even seen any of the. Let's just double check. These are on it. Yeah, so the black ones are gilded. So, uh, creeper eye. Let's keep going. Do we need gilded chests. That was the portal room as well. Okay. Let's go over this way. See what we can find. Come on. 
It'd be great to do a scavenger ball, purely because I've just never done one. I've not been able to finish one yet, so... I'm sure what to do as well for my next talent. Maybe, maybe speed. Maybe. Can we see? See any goodies? Get down there. Let's get down and see. Can we see any chests? Yes, they're the type of chest that we're after. Get straight in. Come on. Be a spider soul charm. There is as well. Excellent. Let's, uh, we may as well loot the rest though. Let's see what else there is. Oh, let's not loot the rest. Don't die. Don't die. Do not die. Where's the way out? That is the way out. It's more important to not die than whatever was going to be in that chest. You! We're going to do it? Yes! I need to make sure I've got inventory space. I believe there's a bug. I don't know if it's still a bug. I believe. Oh, we'll have inventory space anyway, because the thing. I believe there is a bug, or there was a bug, where if you didn't have a, a slot available, you didn't get your crate. Now, I don't know. Oh, you don't have to find the portal afterwards. That's cool. So, like with the model, you should find it back. But with the scavenger ball, you do not. It's a broken chest. Oh, I've already got it. <laughs> We're going home with a completed scavenger chest. Yes! There we was. No XP. Why did we get no XP? Oh! That is a weird one. So you don't get XP for. Hmm. Right, well, let's get some. Let's just make some room. You don't get XP for scavenger vault, seemingly. That's a weird one. Is that an up Oh, well, actually, we already have this amazing helmet, but it's good backup. Hmm. I'm a little confused about why I didn't get XP then. I guess it's because I didn't go through the portal again. Maybe it. Maybe. Let's go put this over here anyway. I hope I get gear now if they're not getting the XP. But, oh, yes! Oh yeah, I think we've got two pieces, three pieces, another helmet, two chest pieces and another helmet, a bolt trinket, I don't know what they do, so we'll have to have a look at that in between episodes. I'm um, just cutting back in, this is editing me. Uh, I did, I pressed that, that trinket, the bolt trinket, I used it, <clears throat> and it gave me this chromatic powder, so I'm guessing there'll be a, there's going to be a slot somewhere, a trinket slot, yeah, and it reduces bolt gear damage with 50%. That's amazing. That is really cool. Anyway, so that's what they are. You just right click them and it, it, it sort of does the spinny thing like when you're doing uh, unlocking a bolt gear piece. And then, yeah. Awesome. Um, some more of these moats. That's cool. A bit of lemon. That's really cool. I'm not probably going to take them in with me all the time. Let's do some ingots. We do want those now because we need to. Um, we want to make our bounty table as quick as we can. But let's see what we get. So let's roll and roll and roll. Either way, we've definitely got an upgrade on the chest. We may even get a better helmet, you never know. Alright, let's see what they look like. Nice. Love it. So, this one is scrappy. This one is common. Let's see. 6% crit resistance, thorns damage, 5% item. Plus 8 mana. 4 armor, 4 armor. This one's better, isn't it? The common one is better. I think so. Let's put that on so it looks like. Oh, he looks cool! Right, and then the helmet. Let's put them next to each other. Uh, the new one's got more armor. Oh, I guess because the other one's level 3. What does it look like? Oh! <laughs> Dark, spiky plate. It doesn't look the best, does it? I mean, the other one looks cooler, but... Yeah, 5 armor, 6% crit chance, 2 armor. 5% ice and quantity. Oh, damage plus 10 mana. Oh, I'm not sure. I mean, the armor's cool. I'm going to wear it. I'm going to wear it and put the other one in backup. Uh, I think my backup ball gear is in here. There it is. Well, is there anything else? No, I think that's it. Brilliant. Well, that was that was the best two bolts. I mean, I'm confused why I didn't get XP, so I didn't get to level 5. But the amount of gear that we just got, wowzers, that was so cool. So that is, I mean, what is it now? It's the 29th of December when I'm recording this. So, and the video will probably be available today anyway, because I think that's what I'm going to do. 
So I definitely won't be doing any more before the new year. I know I've said that already, but that is definitely my last one because I wanted to get this on the go to get one of those tried uh, and that worked out brilliantly so and i mentioned earlier that i'm going to be streaming in the new year and i'd always plan to stream on youtube but i had some issues with if you ever look at youtube live particularly at minecraft there's some not great videos not great streams that are there and the lack of support from youtube on it i mean it's literally silence completely silence so if they as a parent, you know, I wouldn't want my kids finding that horrible stuff and I don't want my content mixed in with it. So uh, I'm going to go and stream on Twitch. So um, here it is. Hit, hit, hit. Here it is, wherever it is. That way, that way, that way. This is my Twitch profile. Uh, it's twitch.tv slash g4g3uk. Uh, it'd be amazing if you could come over and follow me ready. Um, I will sort out a schedule ready for the new year. Um, and it'll probably be a bit loose at the start to see how it goes, see how it fits in around everything else in my life. Um, I'm looking at, I think, two streams a week, maybe even three, and some random ones. Um, but yeah, so looking at probably two streams a week, and I probably will be doing Sky Vaults on there, because I absolutely love playing it, so it'd be great to do a big chunk of it. And yeah, so it's twitch.tv slash g4g3uk. I will put the uh, link in the description below and I'll try and do something nice on the screen here as well so you can see it. Uh, but that's the profile that you can see now. So if you come across that, it's me. All right. I hope you all have a wonderful new year. Uh, I'll see you in 2023. Have a good one. Bye.